Today in WWE 2K24, I'll be hitting a finisher with a wrestler from every letter from A to Z. For the letter A, we're going to start at the top of the list and go with the phenomenal AJ Styles. And here is the phenomenal AJ Styles. I've given AJ three finishers. He actually has a super finisher, but doesn't look like that's the one we're going to hit. Is LA Knight's going to counter our finisher? We're going to counter his finisher right back. Come on, Styles. Hit the Styles Clash first. Here it is. AJ Styles. The Styles Clash. Will we get the pin? Come on. One, two. He kicked out at two, but that's all we need to do. For the letter B, we are going with Bianca Belair. Bianca Belair, the EST of WWE for the letter B. And it's going to be the Battle of the Bs as Bianca Belair and Becky Lynch are going to square off here. Who's going to hit their finisher first? Come on. Are we going KOD? KOD connects. Is it going to be the three on Becky? Come on, ref. Let's go. Two. Oh, we didn't even get a two. What if we do another one? Can two finishers put Becky away? I'm just curious. Let's see. Becky Lynch is down again. Is that going to be the match? Come on, ref. Two. Bianca wins. Let her see who else but the American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes. And bring out the American Nightmare. It is Cody Rhodes. And who else for Cody Rhodes to hit some finishers against? Then Roman Reigns. And I want to hit the super finisher. Come on. Is it going to be the super finisher? Is it going to be the trifecta crossroads? The trinity of crossroads. Come on, Cody. Finish the story. The third crossroads. For the three. Is it going to be one, two, three? Cody Rhodes beats Roman Reigns. For the letter D, we are going with Drew McIntyre. Are we looking at the future world heavyweight champion of WWE, Drew McIntyre? Well, we are about to find out as it's Drew versus Seth, and I believe I'm a running finisher, the Claymore. You can use it as you're running to start a match. And will the Claymore put the world heavyweight champion away? No, he kicks out at one. Might have kicked out a one, Seth, but I'm going to give you two. Two Claymore kicks. If he kicks out of this, we're done here. Will Drew be the new World Heavyweight Champion at Mania? Two. Seth kicked out. For the letter E is Latino Heat. It is Eddie Guerrero. Eddie Guerrero showing up to WrestleMania 20 in style once again for Latino Heat. And Eddie Guerrero. And we're looking at the frog splash. And this one's going to be a little more difficult because we have to make sure that Kurt Angle stays down at first to be able to go to the top rope and connect with the frog splash. And just like that, Kurt rolls out of the way. Also forgot to mention, my webcam is giving me issues today. That's the only reason there is no face cam for this video. And the only letter we will not be doing in this video is Eddie's going to plant Kurt. Can we go to the top rope? No. We'll be oh, here we go. Maybe we can. Now he's down. It's going to be the letter Q as Angle's going to get back up. Nobody in the WWE, their first name, their ring name begins with the letter Q. Eddie, quick, quick. We can do it outside the ring. Eddie Guerrero with the frog splash. Eddie, go up top. He's in perfect position here inside the ring this time for the frog splash. Is that the three? One more win for Eddie Guerrero at WrestleMania 20. How did he kick out? For the letter F, we are going with The Fiend, Bray Wyatt. The Fiend and John Cena are back at the Firefly Funhouse. Pretty cool that this is in the game, I'm not going to lie. And there it is, the Mandible Claw, John Cena down. Will we win the match right here with The Fiend? One, two... Cena kicked out. For the letter G, it's the ring general, Gunther. Here comes the ring general, the longest reigning intercontinental champion of all time, Gunther. And we're looking to hit a power bomb here on Sami Zayn, the WrestleMania opponent of Gunther this year. Will it be a three count to retain the IC title? Kicked out at two, but Gunther needs to retain his title. We're going to hit him with one more. Gunther, one more power bomb should do it. If he doesn't get it done in two, then we're done. But come on, Gunther. You need to retain your IC title. Can you do it? How did he kick out again? Hulkamania is running wild for the letter H. Hulkamania is running wild at WrestleMania for the letter H. We are back at Mania between Andre the Giant and Hulk Hogan. And you know we're going to do it one more time. Hogan slammed the Giant, dropped the leg drop. And will that be a three count? Ref, any slower any slower what in the world are we doing ref for the letter i we're going with the wwe women's champion eo sky the wwe women's champion eo sky we're facing the opponent of eo sky 
at WrestleMania. That is Bailey, and we're looking to hit the moonsault here. Plant Bailey on the canvas. Do we have enough time to go up top? She's in the way. Get up there. Come on, Eo. Hit the moonsault. Hit the moonsault. Oh, she countered it. You got to be kidding me. All right, Eo. We got to hit our moonsault now. Moonsault connects. Can you retain your title? One, two, three. Eo wins. For the letter J, you can't see me. Who else but John Cena? Cena's got the super finisher. Let's see if we can hit it on Orton here. We're looking for the super finisher. Is it going to connect? There's the first AA. Attitude adjustment. Roll through it, John. And it's only two AAs. It should be three AAs, but it's only the two AAs. Is it enough to put Cena's biggest rival away? Two count. We put Orton away with the super finisher. For the letter K, we are going with the Olympic gold medalist, Kurt Angle. And the crowd is reigning with the You Suck chance for Kurt Angle. And we're taking on Shawn Michaels here. And it's going to take a lot out of me to get Shawn to tap here at the beginning of a match. But can we make him do it? The ankle lock. We're going to give it one attempt. It's too difficult at the beginning of a match. We are not going to win this button mash battle as Shawn Michaels is not quite out of there. It is, and he gets out of it. For the letter L, it is L A night. Yeah, let him talk to you now during the entrance. L A night. Yeah. Well, we hit the finisher with AJ Styles on L A night earlier. Now the BFT to AJ Styles, and he kicks out at two. For the letter M, we're going with the Macho Man Randy Savage. The Macho Man Randy Savage. We gotta go to the top rope for the elbow drop that Macho Man made famous. The Ultimate Warrior is down. Macho Man from the top turnbuckle, the elbow drop. Will it be for the three if the ref would ever like to count in this game and is a kick out at two? For the letter N, we are gonna go with Natalia. Natalia, member of the Hart family, looking to hit a finisher. And I got a sharpshooter with Carmella's name on it. And here it comes. Paying homage to the Hart family is the sharpshooter, but can I make her tap out? I didn't have any luck earlier with Kurt Angle and the ankle lock, and I don't have any luck here with Natalia and Carmella. It's just too tough at the beginning of a match. The letter O, it's the giant Amas. And here comes the giant Amas. And I got Amas squaring up with Andre the giant, and there's just no way Amas is gonna pick Andre up and toss him down to the canvas, and he's gonna do it again. The giant versus the giant. Who's coming out on top? Amas is going for three. Oh, and Andre countered the final one as I was trying to maybe hit three and get a pin on him. But we countered his. We countered his finisher. Amas looking for the third finisher. Would it be enough to put Andre the Giant away? We are about to find out. I'm hoping there's no rope break. No rope break. Is three finishers enough? Two. Andre kicked out. Only one superstar in this game with the letter P, and it's Piper Niven. Piper Niven, the only superstar, like I said, with the letter P. P in their name in this game. We got her in the corner. Looking for the Viper Bomb. Piper Niven. Can we win this match with one finisher? We're about to find out. Planting onto Chelsea Green. Will that be the three ref? Come on, ref. Kick out at one, actually. For the letter R, it's the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, Roman Reigns. The longest reigning WWE Champion, in a long time. Roman Reigns still undefeated in singles competition for about four years. Roman, what is his super finisher? I honestly don't know. Is it something in the corner? What would be the super finisher? Three straight spears? We're gonna find out. I think I got the super finisher here. There's one spear. Oh, this is gonna be interesting. Wait, that's it? That's the super finisher? That was his regular finisher last year. Well, we put Kane away, but how is that a super finisher? For the letter S, it's the world heavyweight champion, Seth freaking Rollins. And we gotta get the revenge on Drew. No, Drew just hit us with the Claymore. He has the running finisher. We had to be ready for that. Drew McIntyre just planted Seth Rollins. And now Seth, come on, Seth. The stomp to Drew McIntyre. Is that enough to put Drew away? Come on, Seth. One, two... Kicked out at two. We're going for one more stomp. Would it be enough to retain the title? Seth, is two finishers enough? Come on. One, two. Kick out at two. The letter T, it's the game. Triple H. The game. 
Triple H. It's one of the best entrances, if not the best entrance in WWE history. And for Triple H, we got to hit a finisher against Triple H's best friend in the business. And that is HBK, Shawn Michaels, the pedigree. One, two, kick out of two. What is Triple H's super finisher? Like, what else could it be besides the pedigree? But regardless, let's go for a second pedigree. Will two be enough to put away the Heartbreak Kid? Another pedigree. Triple H. Come on. Ref, you take so long to count. It would be three. And he kicks out. For the letter U, who else but the Phenom, The Undertaker. And if Triple H doesn't have the best entrance in WWE history, The Undertaker does have the best entrance in WWE history. Brother versus brother. Undertaker versus Kane. Who can hit the tombstone first? It'll be the Phenom Tombstone Pile Driver. Is it gonna be enough to put away his brother? Rest in no peace, cause he kicked out. Undertaker though, at WrestleMania, we gotta put Kane away. We can't allow a kick out. We cannot allow a kick out. Undertaker, Tombstone Pile Driver, but we can't have the rope break. Will Kane rest in peace? He will, Undertaker wins. We will go with Vader for the letter V. Vader time, looking for the Vader bomb for the letter V. Let's get MVP in the corner. Then we can hit the Vader bomb. Vader. Here we go. Planting MVP. Going towards the turnbuckle. Got stuck on the... What happened there? That was like a little glitch with the bottom rope. But the Vader bomb connects. Will it be enough for a three count? One. Two. Three. For the letter W, we are going to go with Wade Barrett. We're looking for the bull hammer elbow. Wade Barrett. Ready for it. knocking John Cena out. They had their rivalry back in the day. Is it enough to put Cena away? Wade Barrett gets the win. It's a new day. Yes, it is for the letter X. And we're going with Xavier Woods. It's a new day. Yes, it is. Xavier Woods for the new day. We're going a little new day versus new day action. Kofi versus Xavier. Xavier putting Kofi to the canvas. Now we're going up top. And Xavier Woods looking to put his teammate away. Walking the rope. And there it is. Xavier Woods. Is that enough for the three in the new day? One on one. Two. Three. Xavier Woods wins. The letter Y. There was one superstar in this game. And that is Yoko Zuna. A member of the bloodline. Yoko Zuna. Let's get Roman back in the corner. The tribal chief. The head of the table. Must respect the elders. The headbutt from Yoko Zuna. And now he will take the middle rope as soon as he gets Roman in positioning. And here we go, Yokozuna, the bonsai drop. Will that be enough to put down the tribal chief? Two, he kicked out. And we'll finish it off with Zoe Stark for the letter Z. Zoe versus her former mentor, Trish Stratus. The Z360. Is it enough to win the final match of the video? One, two, and a kick out by Trish. That's going to do it for the video, everyone. If you enjoyed it, do me a favor by hitting the like button and subscribing to the channel. And make sure to go check out my other channels that are in the description down below. And I'll talk to you all in the next one. Peace.